Hey, what's up everybody? We're back with another episode. Today on the show we got a male model. I know you're thinking, it's not me. I could be, I could have been a male model, but instead I'm here giving haircuts in my apartment because this is what I'm passionate about. Looks fade, but haircuts are forever. Is that good? Let's just bring him out. He's the best looking guy I know. Come on out, Niels. <laughs> wow, dude, good to have you here, man. Thank you, thank you. Have a seat. Everybody's on edge today. I know it's a sponsored video. Don't worry, the sponsor's cool. They get it. We could get a little edgy. <laughs> Today's sponsored by Old Spice. We're gonna be using the stylers here. I'm gonna be using this pomade for Niels because his hair likes to blow around in the wind and look beautiful like he's in a movie at all times. And this is a perfect product for that. It's not gonna crust up like your old gel that you used in high school, you slimy scumbags. This is perfect <laughs> if you wanna look like this. Before we start, can we just get the talent release? If you just put your name on there, you don't have to do the whole thing. It's just a talent release. All right, that's it, we got it, cool. That's it, 80% of your earnings for the rest of your life now come to us. You need to get a lawyer, bro. You're right. We saw this picture on your Instagram. Oh, cool. Do you actually smoke cigarettes or? No, 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 I don't. You just did it for the photo? Yeah, it's just a photo. So if I look at your Instagram here, I'm not gonna find any other cigarette pictures? You might find another one that I did for the picture. I'm seeing a couple here. <laughs> that was for the photo too? <laughs> yeah. I might have might have smoked that one while I, while I took the photo, so it had a more real effect. But so if you're doing photo shoots every day and you're smoking a cigarette every day, I think that means you're <laughs> gonna be damaging your health, right? I might be, yeah. Cody, yeah. that's my friend Cody. He just got out of prison. So I heard you're smoking <laughs> in in photos. Do you want your teeth to turn yellow? Definitely not. So what do you think when you see this picture? Do you want to end up downtown LA like that? Yeah, I seriously. went to prison behind smoking cigarettes. He went to prison for smoking cigarettes. For smoking cigarettes. Yeah, then I started doing crap. We just don't want to see you go down the wrong path because we know you have so much potential. He's a good guy, he's a good person. He hasn't done any drugs yet. He just tried cigarettes. It's not the end of the world for yet. Photos, for photos. They were just for pictures. You're justifying it. Thank you, Cody. Appreciate right. it. Thanks, man. I don't think he'll be smoking anymore. It, it looks realistic. Thank you. I'm just spraying a little water. All right, so I know you don't want much of your hair off and you don't trust me. So I'm just gonna be trimming off the dead ends. Is there anything that's off limits in this interview? Uh, no, not really. Cool, man. Your ex-girlfriend, Sydney Wolfie, she's a popular Instagram model. Why'd you guys break up? Just didn't work out. We are better off being friends. So you have you been perfect your whole life or? No, it was more just like a moment. Did you ever have any plastic surgeries to alter your face and your appearance? No. Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> Where'd you learn how to cut hair? Off of YouTube. Really? Mm hmm Tell us something tragic that's happened in your life or to a loved one. Something tragic that's happened. Something terrible. Everyone around is pretty, pretty good right now. Everything in your life is perfect. <laughs> what are we doing? How'd you get your start? I uh, got my start modeling. I got scattered when I was younger from my sister's team and from there I just kind of started posting photos online randomly and one so thing went to another. So when you say you got scouted, that just means like you, somebody just comes up to you and says, hey, I think you got what it takes? Somewhat. I mean, my sister got scouted formally like that and then her agency basically requested to meet me. And I don't even know what guys could model. I don't even know what a model was really. Do you think I have what it takes? I think you have what it takes, man. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. So uh, what's next for you? Lots of stuff coming up. I, uh, for the most part, really would love to see, you know, the companies I'm working on, uh, you know, really come to fruition and have stability. Other than that, I've been acting, so, you know, trying to book a role here or there. Hey, yo, my name is Edward and I'm here to say, I think I can model more than you all think. And if you're smoking up cigarettes, that shit ain't okay. But if I cut your hair, you better pay. <laughs> What's up? I didn't even know you rapped, dude. That was great. Yeah, you know those songs. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you fucking maniac. Did you ever get a bad haircut? Yeah, I had a really bad one time and I'll never forget it. Oh yeah? Yeah. 
Well, tell us about it. How old are you? Where'd you get it from? I was, I was like 10 years old. I went to like a general barber shop and I had a guy who I usually went to, but it was some other dude who cut my hair this time. And I don't even know what he did, but my hair was like layered and it looked like I had a mop, honestly, on the top of my head. And my mom was pissed. Oh, your mom was pissed that you got a bad haircut. You know there's people out there starving. Do you have any advice for people that want to get to where you're at today? <laughs> get better looking. I don't know, dude. I'm, I mean, like, you know, I definitely start with getting their haircut by you. Mm -hmm. it helps. Thank you. Gives you better, you know, chances. Yeah. Other than that, definitely don't smoke cigarettes. And um, what else? This is great so far. Get this shot. This is a nice shot. So where do you see yourself in 10 years from now? Uh, 10 years from now? Yeah. Uh, you know, nice house in the hills. You know, charity, saving the world. Was there like a male model that was like your inspiration that, you know, you looked up to and... You know, I mean, not really. Let's talk about your Team 10 days. All right. How's your relationship with Jake Paul nowadays? Uh, we're friends. Yeah? Yeah, we're cool. I will admit that I... <laughs> Thank you. He always do that. What would you like, how would you like me to style your hair? Um, I'll give you a task. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm getting ready for about a month in Europe. I need to look like beach, cool, you know, sexy, yeah. approachable. You're getting ready for, what'd you say, a month in a Europe? A month in Europe. I'm getting ready for a month of haircuts in my apartment. <laughs> you don't know what it's like, dude. You don't know what I'm going through in this place. I'm losing my fucking mind. All right, uh, I got the perfect thing for you. Okay. It's this spiffy pomade. This is great for on the go hair. It's perfect for a moderate hold and low shine finish. For hair that's reworkable again and again. It's good for you when you go out, you get some breakfast, you have a croissant and a cigarette. <laughs> out in France, where are you going? I'm gonna be in Spain. I'm gonna go to Marbella, and Ibiza, and then I go to Mykonos. And then the end of the month, I go to Belgium. You drink alcohol? Can I answer that? <laughs> yeah. I mean, only only in Europe, you know. It's, okay. Yeah. All right. Dude, your hair is perfect, man. You really think so? Yeah. Thanks, man. It means a lot, cause. Did you? Honestly, I I really like your hair. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Thanks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Right now, I am putting my fingers, I'm just gently pushing them through your glorious locks here, your golden glorious locks. You ready for the big reveal? Yeah, I'm ready. Check it out, dude. Looks nice. You look pretty much the same. Just nah, it's better. Just a little, a little tiny bit better, right? I think it's much better. Better than this guy? <laughs> Definitely better <laughs> than that guy, yeah. Well, this is where you're going if you don't use Old Spice. Okay. And you stop smoking cigarettes. Got it. Dude, you're a real good sport, bro. You're way cooler than all my friends. <laughs> like all the Vlog Squad guys, they are like, oh, I'm not coming back to Jeff. He makes everything so awkward. I can't tell if he's joking or not. I feel like he's gonna stab me. <laughs> Have fun in Europe. Tell all your friends that I'm a good person and I wanna do good in the world. And yeah, man, check out Old Spice. It's good stuff. What?
Yeah, I'll just follow this one. Alright. Here, I got a shirt. Look here, though. That's good. <laughs> Look at that. What? <laughs> You're looking like so enviously. <laughs> no, I'm seeing what he's doing. I'm getting inspiration from him. I'm not f***ing copying him. 